What's up guys? Welcome to Mr. Fazl. Today we are at BCS Educational Center, the best educational center in Karshi and we are going to make a little challenge. So watch out. Searching for greatness in a sea of the dying and shameless. Uh, a sea of the aimless. I don't want to be one of the nameless. I'm going to wake up with the mindset that one day I'm going to make it. And I don't think I'll be fine if I don't break my limitations. First of all, we're going to ask three questions. And who answers the first and correct the question will get the chance to say as many words as she or he, he or she can. And we will give 100. Uh, sums for every word. For example, if it's 500 words, it means 50,000. If it's 1,000 words, that means 100,000. Without any catch. Clear? Simple and clear. The question start now. So, I'm gonna begin from the simple ones and the next ones will be a little bit challenging, maybe. So, the first question. Everything? Could you spill the word fulfill? Who? <laughs> oh, no answers? It's good. F U W L F E A L. Incorrect. I let the F take it. That's yeah. awesome. Who else? Who else? Just, it's a good chance. Really, it's a great chance. I will give you. Fast the teacher. Uh, it's F F U W L F I L. It's one out. <laughs> Let's change the question, okay? Which word in English has the maximum number of definitions? Is it a difficult question? Like, for example, you can mean get. Well, you can use get in different situations, right? With different meanings. And there's another word which has so many number of definitions. So it's kind of number one word. Yeah. What, have? No, not, it's not have. Make? Make? No, Take. not me. It's, I will say, it's a three letter word. Is it word? It's, it's, it's can be a word, a noun, an adjective, an adverb. Can. Can, no, but can. It means it's S. Say no. Say no. Say no. <laughs> not see, it's not see. Oh, it, it was an easy question actually. That's very fun. Class. Is it an I of the school? No. no. Ah, I see. Yeah. So sorry. Zach, let, um, okay. You can use this word uh, with LR. It is a, some kind of phrase, a word. Or idiom, yeah. you can let's use with alarm. Kind of, uh, we, <coughs> we have a chalk. Okay, three dots blank, so, and uh, have all. So. Yeah. <laughs> that was correct. The first question was found by her. And the next question Which is the shortest? Complete sentence in English. Shortest complete sentence in English, according to statistics. Okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> that's also correct, but uh, according to statistics, uh, that's another word. It's a verb. Done, maybe. Done has four letters. Yes. It's double amount of. <laughs> I'm new, come back better than last year. It's a new me, never gonna look back. Never gonna look back. Cause damn, I was built to last. You move slow when I move fast. And that's fact. Only I can make a change. Slowly take a step today. I will never be the same. Cause that's what it takes. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> 
Today it has been three days since we have recorded that video and still there is no sign of 
the winner contacting with us. That's why I decided to put 50,000 in this envelope and give it to our teacher, Mr. Shirala Holub, so that he will give uh, this envelope to her. Maybe that was because of her, her shyness, maybe something else. Anyway, and I also want to give this book by Macmillan Dictionary as a bonus. That's all.